What's up, guys? Me Time Gamer here. Going to start a new game for you guys called Jalopy. So uh, this is a brand new game. It just came out on April twenty second, twenty sixteen. So let's get started. Roll the intro. <laughs> Alright guys, so basically this game, what it's all about is basically, well, Jalopy, is, most of you guys know Jalopy is basically another word for a worn out piece of crap car. So basically, this is an early access game, it just came out, and the, the main purpose of the game, uh, what I could understand, I watched uh, one video so far, because before I bought it, I wanted to see what it was, and basically the game is you have to, the car, as you can see in the, over here, uh, the car, you have to, um, you start off by assembling old crappy parts to it and you have to travel across uh, Eastern Europe or uh, that part of the, of the country and um, you have to put parts and then as you go along you have to change tires upgrade your parts and basically upgrade the car as you go to make it run better and make it last longer uh, find way that you have to put gas in it and all those things so um, yeah so uh, well, let's just start playing the game shall we Oh no, this damn alarm clock. My worst enemy. Oh my god. Wake up! Wake up! Uh, awake, finally. Hmm. Stay in bed any longer and the day will make fools of us both. Alright, if you say so. Come on, I've got something important to show you. Awesome. Come, come. It's just outside. Alright, so basically... So basically, this is the game. Uh, the graphics are pretty cool. I like them so far, what I've seen. Alright. Can you walk a little bit faster, sir? Your, your coat is trippy, though. There's like high six on one deluxe. Something of an engineering legend in the GDR. Alright. Zero six kilometer in twenty two seconds. Top speed of hundred kilometer all the caramel rate of nine kilometers per liter. Nine kilometers per liter. Okay, that's a weird way weird way of um, calculating that. Usually you say the number Usually here you say the number of liters per hundred kilometers. I don't know if in Europe they calculate the number of kilometers per liters. It's kind of weird. Not to worry, everything's ready. We'll just need to build build her an engine, slap some wheels, and fit the passenger side door and give her a bit of a clean. All right, if you say so. I've done this in real life. So in real life, let's do this right now. Replacement door. Top scrap behind you. Okay. Okay. You squint. All right. Okay. 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 Careful. Careful. This should, I'm surely, surely safe doing this. All right. All right. We got the door slowly, slowly. Got this from a an even better, uh, better condition. Even better condition car. Okay. 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 Let's fit the engine. You open the driver's side door, you'll see a black latch. Pull that and you release the bonnet. The bonnet? Call that a hood. Okay, squinty, squinty. Okay, yes. This lever. Not like a gentleman, I will close the door. We'll close the door. Go. Uh -huh. You can see she needs an engine. Um, yeah, she definitely does. Got a load of stock parts sat in it. 
I've got a load of stockpiles sat in the garage. Go collect one and I'll walk you through what it does. Sure, why not? Okay, okay. Okay, let's we'll start with this little baby. Parts are set. Yeah, I got it, I got it. Alright. It's a carburetor, which controls the fuel consumption to the car, which turns the control turns controls how many kilometers per liter you'll get out of a light car. Good, well-maintained carburetor will mean you le it's less fuel and can drive further. For cheaper. Go ahead, drop it into the engine. Drop it right in there. Alright, stock carburetor. Next part. Battery. Bat big power. That's there that there the battery, which provides electrical charge for your Leica. Lakai, Leica. The battery allows you to use lights, radio, the car ignition, that kind of thing. Lakai will start the first place to check is the battery. Go ahead, drop the battery. E the battery is in. Stock engine. You able to lift this? Oh Jesus Christ, strongest man alive. Alright, alright. Tell me what this does, old man. That's the engine plug you got there. The core of your Lakai is set. The engine block defined core performance of your Leica. Loading top speed and acceleration. Poorly kept engine block will mean your Lakai will struggle to perform. Go ahead, drop it into the engine. Okay, okay. Okay, so there's stats there everywhere on the paper, so we'll figure that out once we uh, start playing the game in a further, further part. Stock air filter. Assuming this filters air. Oh, you're holding the air filter. A non-essential component. Non-essential, you say. The air filter isn't necessarily required to run to the high, but it's a good idea to have one. It's a reduced rate of wear of your engine block. There you go, that's a good idea. Go ahead, drop it in there. Okay. That is a stock ignition coil. Ignition coil. So I'm assuming this takes place in the 80s somewhere. That little thing is an ignition coil. Ignition coil channels an electrical charge to start the engine. An ignition coil that is bad condition may struggle to start the engine. Go ahead, drop it in the engine. Seems like it goes over here. Next part. Fuel tank. So, oh, oh, is the fuel tank which holds the fuel for your Lakai? You notes on this one first. Well, it's gravity fed, so we will need to open the bonnet and fill directly to the tank when fueling. Really? Also, your Lakai is running a two-stroke engine. This means you'll want to mix in some oil to the fuel. Sure. Here, to mix the oil into the fuel will mean the engine will. Located and will wear crease rate. Too much oil through though and it will start warm and strong. Keep your fuel tank well maintained. Let it go too beaten up and it start leaking fuel everywhere. Go ahead, put it drop it in the engine. Okay, and the last part is water tank. I'm guessing this filters my uh, headlight fluids, right? That's the water tank, which provides water to help keep your windscreen clean from dirt. Keep it in good condition and it'll start to leak, or you'll start to leak water and you'll soon find yourself driving without a vision, any vision. Go ahead, drop it into the engine. Okay, that's everything installed. Good. Good job. Now fill her up. We're getting nowhere without fuel. Oh shit. 
tuned to fill the car with petrol, oil, water. Go and collect them all and I'll walk you through the refueling. Okay. So we got petrol. Or gasoline in North America. Good, that's the can of fuel you're holding there. Awesome. We use that on the fuel cap, the fuel tank. Just install in filling the car fuel. Okay. Q to try. Okay. It's the oil. This That's a bottle of two stroke oil. You'll got in your hands there. You want to add a drop of it to improve the fuel mixture which affects things like performance and engine work. Clean mixture was all in the faster car but won't it increase wear to the engine. A rich mixture was all in the And now the water. Guess I'm gonna fill up the water tank with this there, fella. Oh, you got a bottle of water. Good job. Using that in a water tank, we install and fill the water. Good idea. Good job, if you're done with it. Excellent. Let's move on to the tires. Tires with a Y. What the fuck? Let's get some tire in the car. Okay. So as you can see, we won't get very far without any wheels. Yeah, I'm pretty sure those blocks won't do the trick. There's a car jack over there in the garage. Bring it over and we can get started. Where is the car jack? Right there. <coughs> Hi. Place the jack under the car. Now you can twist the handle. Go ahead and drop that. Okay, there you go. Drop it. Okay. Oh, some tires. Tire? Tire? Can I grab another one? I mean, that's the strongest guy ever. He's carrying three tires. Good. Just fit in the road tire. On the axle. You're sort of standing in my way. <coughs> Sorry about that. Good, they can drop the car jack down and we can do the same again on the other side. <coughs> Sorry about that. Now just twist the handle. Don't worry, I got it. I got it when we did it on the other side there, Jack, buddy. I already got that. Mm-hmm. 
Okay. I want to wait till I take the fucking jack out of there, buddy. I'm guessing this slows me down a bit. Since it's adding weight to the car. Right. I do keep in mind this is still early access so it might fuck up. I don't know. Oh, oh. Is there anything else I can grab? Let's go see in the scrapyard if we got some. I think I'm gonna need these blocks. Oh really? Hmm. I guess they like to keep their shit clean here. Alright, close the back truck. Close the, the, the bonnet or the hood. Alright, let's sit down. Here we have the maintenance manual. Oh, Jesus Christ. Come cover the basic running the car. Okay. Instruction. Regarding basics over here of the car vehicle, detail current engine set, listing of cargo we're currently carrying, this sort of thing. You can turn the page by selecting the top corner of each page. Oops. Oops. This one is part of the us to select which would be taken. Okay. See our first destination is a CSFR border crossing near Dresden. I've marked all of the potential route I know of, including weather conditions and any stop points along the route. Go ahead and select one now. Alright, so, uh, obviously, I think we're gonna go with the shortest route. What are you saying? I, c I can't, uh oh, uh oh, please don't. Okay. Once I've selected, we're committed to driving it. Okay. And again, you can turn pages to the ground, the other pages to include the statistic tracking and lock tracking. Okay, Q, drop that shit. Okay, I guess you want me to look at it. I'll walk through later, go ahead and drop it. And finally, the keys. Yes, most essential. These bubbles are pretty fucking weird. Just pop them into ignition and show all yours. Okay. Okay. Okay, we got Jesus. Okay, we got our emergencies. A 
the radio. One channel. Need a smoke. Alright. Guess that's mean we're ready to roll. Oh Jesus Christ. Oof. Oh god damn, I already hit the car. So begins our journey. Yes it does. On the road again. Oh shit. Slow the fuck that. On the road again. Dressed in. Well, traveling to Autobahn for the first part. Which gives us a chance to get a grip with the Lakai, yeah. Get a grip indeed. This drives like poo poo right now. Oh no, we're on the boat. These, these fucking things. Okay, it's our turn. Oh Jesus. Oh mercy. Am I going the right way? Car sounds like it's running on hopes and dreams. Okay. Restaurant so we can cross the border into Chersosa Lexus. Oh shit. Yes. Socialist Republic, okay. Is there like another car beside me or the check and slowly for the rope? Okay. Anywhere you go, man, I'm I'm gonna follow you. Oh actually you're following me. What the fuck? Be more careful. You think I'm trying to beat here, buddy? Oh my god, are you It's a bit weird of handling, as it's free looked. Sort of way back. Okay, okay, we got it. 40 years, and now a wall. Okay, so we're in Berlin. Oh my god, this fucking driving. Dresden, okay, okay, we're going to Dresden. The wobble, the wobble. What the fuck are you saying? I have no clue what you're saying. Oh my god, you see your... <laughs> Penalty? <laughs> oh my god. My car is not liking me right now. Oh my god, I'll get it. I'll get it, I'll get it.
Okay, and right here. Alright guys, for the first video, this is where I'm going to stop. Thank you so much for watching the video. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the game. Controllers are very weird in this game, so I'll try to make a couple of adjustments to how I'm playing it just so it's easier for me. So hopefully you guys enjoy enjoyed the video as much as I love making these videos. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it, please. Uh, also subscribe to the channel, really appreciate that. You can follow me at MeTimeGamer on Twitter. Uh, Twitch.tv forward slash MeTimeGamer if you want to follow me on Twitch, of course. Uh, I'm live usually most of the week. I'll, I try as much as I can. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Keep on keeping on.